In this session, I'm going to demonstrate how to insert multimedia in a slide in PowerPoint Presentations 2013. Uh, by multimedia, what I mean is inserting video and audio files. So in this case, first, I'm going to demonstrate how to insert video. Now, this is new in PowerPoint 2013, and in some cases, you might have issues with this by inserting videos from online, and this is that feature of inserting online video. So basically the way it works is that you go here under video, click on online video, and then you can either embed code from somewhere on the web, or you can go ahead and embed a video from YouTube. And this is with the latest version and updates for PowerPoint. So if this doesn't work in your computer, the problem might be related that you don't have the latest updates installed in there. So if I go to YouTube here and I go ask Sally, uh, there are a bunch of YouTube videos that I have there and now let's say I want any of those videos to be presented here. Just pick any of them, let's say using Word 2013 and then click on insert. Once you click on insert, you can resize this and then at this point this is linked to YouTube and it's going to be streaming it from here when you present it. So in this case, let's go ahead into presentation mode to present it. Click on slideshow, choose from current slide or shift F5. And then notice it has the play button at this point. To present it, you just click and it will start playing basically the embedded video into your slideshow. It's different. It looks more whitish and this is more... Uh, by the way, you can check this tutorial. It's a full video tutorial in Microsoft Word as well that is available for you to view. The other thing that you can do is that you can insert video from the PC itself. So I'm going to insert a new slide here. And in this case, we're going to insert a video from the PC. So we click here on video, video on my PC. Of course, you have to find where you're uh, video stuff is and so on. So in this case here I have a sample video that I can I have on my computer. You can resize this if you needed to and now let's present it. Let's test and see whether it works. So we click here from the current slide. It's going to come up like this. Then you press play. We could have resized it if we wanted to make it full screen and things of that nature. And there it is. So this is basically when you have the video clip in your computer. The previous example was when you have uh, the video embedded from YouTube. You'd need, in this case of the first case, you'd need to have the internet connectivity when you're presenting it. So it's a little bit more risky if the internet is not working. Now inserting sound is the next item here that I'll demonstrate in this video. We click on insert, then we go under audio and then you could choose online audio if you know where the audio might be or you could record new audio directly from the PC at this point to embed it in your PowerPoint or you can choose audio from my PC. So we go here under audio on my PC and then go and locate your audio. And now in this case we have this audio clip here. We could move this to wherever we want it. And um, then when you go to present this, you can make this so that it plays automatically or you can, you'd have to click on play and it'll start playing in your video or in your presentation. And by the way, the way you control the playing of this, it's basically under the options here for playback. Right now it's configured to play on click but you can change it so it plays automatically and it plays across all slides and by the way that's how you can have a song or some kind of music in the background you apply it at the beginning of the audio or in the first slide and then you choose to play automatically and then play across all the slides until you stop it so basically that's how it works and you have also the play in the background. So again, as you're tinkering with this stuff, make sure you click on the options here or double click on the option and see what new tabs show up. In other cases, you could right click on this content and then change 
different properties such as the preview and all that type of stuff that might be available for that object. So that's how you insert multimedia in your slide in PowerPoint 2013.